Welcome back to our channel where we explore the lives of some of our favorite actors from the past. Today we will be covering the Batman TV series from 1960s. In this video we will be taking a look at the cast members of the show and their ages during the series. Also with their first and last clips ever recorded. First on our list is Batman himself, played by Adam West. During the series he was around 38-39 years old. Unfortunately, he passed away on June 9th, 2017, at the age of 88. Hey, that riffraff in the bar? They may be drinkers, Robin, but they're also human beings. And may be salvaged. I had to do it. Who's waited the longest <laughs> to get his star on the sidewalk. <laughs> Bert Ward played Robin, the boy wonder. He was around 20 to 21 years old during the series and is still alive today. Holy armor plate, holy transistors, holy wigs, holy Rashevsky, holy trickery, holy felony, holy geography, holy nick of time, holy jackpot. I'd like to thank everybody involved, the Hollywood Chamber and all the people that I've met there. Very nice. I want to thank all of you. Next, we have Alfred Pennyworth, played by Ellen Napier. He was around 65-66 years old during the series and passed away on August 8, 1988, at the age of 85. Not only contributing my bit, I like to feel that I'm part of the team, sir. Then you will, sir. Let me replace you in this crafty charade. It's difficult, camera-wise, to have a good coherent picture in that little box. Neil Hamilton, played by Commissioner Gordon, who was around 64 years old during the series. He passed away on September 24, 1984, at the age of 85. Police headquarters. I uh, switchboard, Commissioner Gordon here. Plug me in at once into the hotline bat phone circuit. Yes? Put any fears you may have had aside, Commissioner. We're back in action. Batman, Batman, the answer to a policeman's prayer. Thank you. Stafford Rapp played Chief O'Hara who was around 50 years old during the series. Unfortunately, he passed away on November 5, 1974, at the age of 56. The commissioner has just stepped out, Batman. Uh, this is Chief O'Hara. I'm in charge here for the time being. Well, thank heavens I reached you, Chief O'Hara. There's treachery in- If I could only get me Mitch around your neck, I'd try you! You'd be- Pull yourself together, Chief O'Hara. Pull yourself together, Chief O'Hara. The Joker was played by Cesar Romero. He was around 57 years old during the series and passed away on January 1, 1994, at the age of 86. <laughs> oh, how delicious it is! The Everybody was there a nickname, mm -hmm. a nickname that didn't shoot them particularly. Right, right. And when he got to me, he said, your name is Butch, and everybody laughed, and uh -huh. they kept calling me Butch, and it suddenly became a name. I've been Butch ever since. Burgess Meredith played the Penguin, who was also around 57 years old during the series. He passed away on September 9, 97, at the age of 89. What charge, boy wonder? Oh, tut tut, Batman. I only make the umbrellas. What they do after they leave here is hardly my affair now, is it? Like a bum, Wolfie. Now go win. Like a bum, Wolfie. Now go win. Frank Gorshin played the Riddler, who was around 34 years old during the series. Unfortunately, he passed away on May 17, 2005, at the age of 72. Thought you might be Batman. That's why I brought witnesses with cameras. Oh, what is it that no man wants to have, yet no man wants to lose? It's the afternoon, you know, mm -hmm. and I'm sitting in the cocktail lounge. I looked up, and there's Burt Lancaster coming through the front door. He comes over to me, and he says, hi, I'm Burt Lancaster. <laughs> Julia Newmar played Catwoman, who was around 34 years old during the series. She is still alive today. I know that Batman and Robin will swallow the bait. And when they do, I'll be rid of that dynamic duo once and for all. You have paradise. And why not have it right outside your back door? I believe in treating myself well, don't you? You want Craig played Batgirl, who was around 30 years old during the series. Unfortunately, she passed away on August 17, 2015, at the age of 78. Tricked me into revealing my secret by posing as a minister. Oh. Well, then I apologize. 
That was a very brave thing to do, Alfred. I do my stunts, and I ultimately did my own stunts. I mean, I kind of talked them into that. Um, they knew uh, that I danced. David Wayne played the Mad Hitter, who was around 55 years old during the series. He passed away on February 9, 95, at the age of 81. My super instant mesmerizer, it never fails. Okay, boys, carry him out. Rambler and knocked the Detroit Giants for a loop. And big fins and fat land yachts went out of style. So, what's American Motors got up its sleeve for 66? It's not size. Roddy McDowell played the bookworm, who was around 36 years old during the series. Unfortunately, he passed away on October 3, 98, at the age of 70. Oh, dear me. <laughs> what feeble memories you have. <laughs> However, Shades of Shakespeare. Who, who is he? <laughs> who is out there? George Sanders played Mr. Freeze, who was around 64 years old during the series. He passed away on April 25, 1972, at the age of 65. I don't want to kill you. No. A lioness with her cubs. Correction, cub. Oh, I'm such an ancient cub now. When do I get thrown out of the cave? Victor Bono played King Tut, who was around 28 years old during the series. He passed away on January 1, 1982, at the age of 43. Phase two will now be put into being. Are there any questions? I got one. You may speak, Royal Scrivener. Batman who used to do Batman. I promise to be gentle, kind, and pleasant. But first, I'm gonna knife the little peasant. <laughs> <laughs> Lastly, we have Cliff Robertson, who played Shane. He was around 41 years old during the series and passed away on September 10, 2011, at the age of 88. You look grimmer than a losing football coach. Insulting you, do you run out of cheeks to turn? If you need to be vitriolic, fight. And who's been happily married for 22 years is and no longer married, it's got to be a little lonely. I've got my cat, Halsey, <laughs> and uh, he's imperious and impossible. That's it for our video on the cast of the 1966 Batman series. Then and now. Leopard. Holy bat trap. Holy hotfoot. Holy mush. Holy iodine. Holy paraffin. Which cast member surprised you the most? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this. How'd they get up there? They took the elevator. What do you think? Also, please share your memories with this series in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Do not forget to subscribe.